What's happening guys? This is the Lone Wolf Tech coming back to you with some Volts Let's Play. Now, um, some really cool things to go over with you. A new version of Volts has come out. So now we are running uh, Volts 1.0.11, which um, incorporates, I think, one new mod. I'm not sure which mod that is because when I looked it up online, it just said there was updates. And um, it says it updated, uh, you know, every... Uh, mod but when you first log in it says like railcraft needs updates and stuff so I don't know what's going on there but uh, we got that going and the audio might sound a little bit better or weird because I gave up on trying to uh, use fraps to record my game audio because it sounds terrible so I'm trying audacity and um, so might have a little bit of problem uh, synchronizing the two but hopefully the audio will sound better um, but first, let's get to the mods. So, uh, first thing, I, I don't know all the changes, but I have seen a few. First thing, we have some textures for uh, our machines, not the enrichment chamber, but uh, it looks like our enrich or yeah, the enrichment chamber, uh, basic smelting factory, and electric furnace all have um, some new textures. Now, another really, really, really cool thing, excuse me, that they added is now you can actually uh, uh, well if you watched the videos before you know we couldn't do anything with the copper dust well now we can actually smelt it so um, it should work with tin yep so we're actually smelting um, copper and tin dust now which is really useful now you'll notice that power bar going down which is a worry because it says we have zero megajoules and that is because of this basic energy cube it cannot fill up and it keeps on using energy even though I'm not doing anything so what I'm going to do is going to break that guy real quick and see if this guy fills up is he going to fill up? come on you're almost there so close you can do it come on ah, it doesn't look like he's filling up and we're not getting any power so what I'm going to do is just break this guy for now um, because I like for my machines to have power Hopefully we'll get some power. I don't really know what's going on. The heat generators are kind of weird enough, but uh, one thing you can notice is we uh, like there are connected textures, or at least not connected textures, but uh, for the uh, cables, they can actually connect now, which is really useful. And I don't know really what's going on. I had this problem before. Uh, we're getting power from these guys, so I don't really know fuel. I don't know why it says fuel now. Maybe we gotta put something in there. We shouldn't though. That's how they work if I can get out of here. Oh uh, well, we'll we'll worry about that uh, some other day. Uh, but back on to updates. Um, one of the most important updates I believe is the update to wire. Um, now there are actually more wire. We have our copper wire like usual, and then we have, you know, insulated copper wire, and then a bunch of other wires. Um, but mostly important is the res. Uh, apparently, I'm on cheat mode for some reason. The most important is the uh, recipe for copper wire, which, as you can see now, uses uh, leather or wool. So, my complaint in previous episodes was it's pointless trying to get leather you know that much leather because it takes forever I spend most of my time getting leather from cows well now we can actually use sheep which makes more sense and we can actually uh, get sheep a little bit easier so I ran around ran around ran around I can't even say ran around and found some sheep so we'll just go ahead and feed them so now we don't have to continuously kill things to get uh, wire we can just shear them which is really nice so we're going to be doing that uh, mostly in the future we're not going to get rid of our cows because I, I kind of grow, grown fond of them so we're going to make some more sheep babies yep so make love we got some brown sheep and some white sheep because we ain't racist we're not racist so we're actually not going to do much right now except actually we'll, we should probably shear them um but we need more sheep. So we're running low on iron. Which could be a problem here soon. I believe this is... Oh, it's just two. And that's even better. 
So, we got plenty of cows though, so we could go kill some cows if we needed to. Come on. There we go. So, we're going to shear you, get some brown wool. I don't think we can't shear the babies. Come here. Everyone's got to get cut. So, just from those four uh, sheep, we already got six wool, which is one short of making uh, six wire. So, that's not actually that bad. So what's going to happen is we're going to get a lot of um, sheep and we'll just be able to shear them up as we need it. And that's going to work out a whole lot better. i got to pick up that energy cube before it despawns. Got some more iron. Give me this. We'll go sticky with the other machines. Are we getting power yet? No. So I think this guy looks like he's using a lot of power. Um, none of the other machines are. So we might actually have to... They might have done an update to the uh, to the heat generators as where they don't get enough uh, electricity. So you might need to add more heat generators, which is understandable. So now that we have those um, updates, what I can do that doesn't go in there is show you. Uh, there's basically still the same uh, same mods. Like I said, I do not know uh, exactly what mods were added which is kind of a bummer but basically the same stuff going on in here it looks like there are maybe a little bit more items but anyway like I said in previous episodes we need to work for automated Ooh, we got some black sh oh that's just because they're sheared we need to work uh, toward getting automated uh, mining going which we're going to use tunnel boards for that so what we need to start on today is making some mine carts. So I know we need one furnace cart and I know we're going to need one chest cart. As you can see I've already stocked up on gravel. We uh, we got a couple tracks. We don't want to go that. Actually we could make a few more um, here real quickly. There we go. So we got almost two stacks of tracks I think we actually no just just short um, so we got plenty of tracks and we need some carts we actually need a lot of carts we'll make two for now we need to make a furnace and we need to make a furnace cart we got plenty of coal sitting around so for the recipe for tunnel bore uh, we need three carts and a chest cart um, so we might actually get really low on uh, on some iron but that should be alright alright so we got three there and we're going to need um, some wood now I want to kinda go ahead and make everything so next episode well we could probably run into it this episode I just try to make it not too long um, let's see if Audacity tells me how long I've been recording for. Um, eight minutes. So, yep. We'll try not to make it that long. Um, just because I wanted to show you that, uh, there is an update. I wasn't sure if I was actually running the update, uh, if I was running a, an older version of this, or if there just was an update released, but I didn't see anything on the, um, uh, on the Technic website about changes other than updates, so, there we go. But we'll go ahead and make it since we just need two more furnaces and then uh, two blocks of steel. So it's not that hard. We need some steel. We got plenty of steel. <clears throat> I've been doing that a while. Uh, we're still running the same version of vanilla Minecraft, so that's still like 1.4.7 or something like that. I'm not really that much into vanilla Minecraft, as in I don't remember uh, all that all that other stuff that goes along with it. Okay, we need our furnaces. So we got a tunnel board, so that's pretty basic to make. Now, uh, if you haven't watched the Tekken episode, uh, you need to go back and watch our Railcraft series. Um, but if we remember correctly, a tunnel board, unless I changed it, uh, needs needs coal. Uh, a tunnel bore head 
and gravel and track. So we got track, gravel, and coal. So we're gonna need a boar head. So for that, we can't get a diamond one, I'm pretty sure. We could get an iron one or a steel one. We might as well go for steel. So that's just uh, steel blocks surrounded by steel. Pretty uh, simple to make. Now, these will run up much quicker than in diamond ones, so we might have to actually replace it. But that shouldn't be much of a problem once we start getting material in. So now that we have that, we got our chest cart, we got our furnace cart, we got our crowbar. We can get the rest of our tracks and gravel. We're going to need our coal. Uh, I'm going to take more coal than that. Two should be fine. We don't want it going super, super to duper to far. And we got that. And we need to look how much a world anchor is. I'm pretty sure those are very expensive. So that's two diamonds, an ender pearl, gold. Um, so we actually just need one more diamond and we can make a, uh, a uh, world anchor. Man, I can't even. Now that I got this awesome recording program, I can't even think about what I'm saying. So um, that's pretty much what we want to do today. Um, just quick updates on stuff that's changed. You know, there's probably more that I didn't notice, and I will find out along the way. Um, BT Dubs sheep um, do work with. You can use wheat on sheep, so that's good. I don't know if that was just random glitch or something, but um, that works. Um, automated steel works so far as long as we put keeping iron in there which we're not putting the iron in there enough um, these guys should be working I mean they're generating jewels I don't I'll, I'll Google after this episode uh, what what they need in that ex extra slot if they need anything uh, we'll check our power real quick as it turns nighttime still no power what if we take both these guys out so yeah, we get power, um, we get quite a bit of power actually. So that basic smelting factory just takes a lot of power runs. So what we might do is go ahead and um, get uh, some more heat generators going. Um, but I'll probably do that in my spare time because that's going to be something simple to make and we've already made them before. So. Uh, yeah guys, if uh, you liked the video, um, don't complain about my audio if it's screwed up because that's going to be interesting to actually uh, edit out. So if you like the video, please like and subscribe to the Tech... or not the Tech... Pro well, go ahead and like and subscribe to the Tech Project while you're at it and make sure you go to Let's Play Vaults and like and subscribe to that as well. And um, yeah, I'll see you later.